hi guys welcome back to my channel so we're here again with another foundation friday so if you want to see what foundation i test out you already know what to do keep on watching <laughs> Okay, so we're back and time to talk about this foundation. Again, I've already primed. I'm using my Peter Thomas Roth Instant Firm No Filter Primer. And I'm using my, and I have my full filter corrector from Huda Beauty. So let's talk about this foundation. One, two, three, four, five, six, 12, 14 shades. And it is the LA Colors Truly Matte Long Wearing High Pigment Foundation. I got this from like um, five and below, and this was the darkest shade, which is warm honey. And I can tell you, honey, this is not gonna match me, but you know what? We're gonna make it work. So after this, I think the shade that would have matched me is maybe 360 Cafe, Cafe but they didn't have that shade. But yeah, let's read a little bit about the shade foundation it said it's long wear wearing high pigment formula applies as a liquid and blends into a beautiful matte powder like finish available in 14 shades to complement a wide range of skin tones 14 shades is not gonna complement a large range of skin tones first let's get that out of the way but it has actually it has more than the regular it has 1.35 fluid ounce or 40 milliliters and there's a lot of like good reviews about love it love it love it um amazing affordable foundation oh and by the way this is six dollars six dollars but i got it from five and below so i pay five dollars so without further ado let me give this a shake Oh, this are, this makes me so nervous because I already know I already know this is gonna be light like maybe further down into winter maybe oh my god look at this <laughs> ah, oh my god and I have to go out like this is I have to go out and this is wow white and this is my flawless brush by penny makeup by rando i don't know this is not this is not it i'm scared to put more but you know what we're already here right why not just complete the casper the friendly ghost look i got snacks oh i got popcorn i got caramel corn i got kettle corn right right You know, the finish is not terrible, and maybe if it wasn't so white, it would have worked out to be, you know, a little better, but we're here, and we're just gonna make this work. Kind of. I don't know how we're gonna make it work. Man, I go from, like yesterday, I did... I, recorded a, a video and my foundation match me like so good and now today we're here and the thing is like this does not have a lot of coverage what did it say well it's it didn't say it was full coverage but it did say it was high pink <laughs> The thing is, like, I knew this was not gonna match. Like, it's not like this is news to me. I literally got it knowing it was gonna be that light. But I was like, okay, you know. So I don't see the matte finish. I, I definitely see that. But 
I don't see high pigment. Like you can see all my stuff here. And I'm gonna give it a little bit more like right here. Cause that's kinda where I have most of my issues or skin issues, but I'm done with this cause this is light. So as I can find the cover, which I can't. So we're just gonna move on. <sighs> and this is my makeup forever concealer it's like my concealer and my foundation is the same color or same shade like that's what and my concealer is usually two shades light. This is one thing. Maybe that's the look I'm going for. I don't but maybe not. That's not the look I'm going for. This is just. This is too much. Too much. Yeah, like. My foundation and my concealer just looks like one thing. Perfect. So I don't know, it doesn't look too bad. Something you have to tell it to yourself, you know? That makes you feel better, kind of. <laughs> okay, so this is how everything is laying on this foundation. It looks fine. I just don't know how it's gonna actually survive. So we're gonna go at the tongue. We'll be pretty long day, pretty long day. It's gonna, you know, be put to the test. And I will give you guys my final thoughts at the end of the night after I do two check-ins during the day. So see you guys later. You think I'm acting brand new. But this was me before you ain't nothing to start over. Hold me on a new vibe, bitch. You blowing my high. Gotta recalibrate my sundial. Yeah, reset. Ain't nothing to start over. Hold me on a new vibe, bitch. You blowing my high. Hi guys, so I am doing my first check-in. Look at this though. It's like fall, and I am still wearing summer clothes. But yeah. Um, by now I've been wearing this foundation maybe for about two hours, but look at my eyes. My eyes are making like water, which is not good because I mean, pretty soon my lashes gonna start coming off. But yeah, I think I've been wearing this foundation for about two hours. Um, uh, looks like I have a little bit of separation by my nose, but nothing too crazy. So I'm just gonna keep wearing this. Um, I'm gonna have breakfast at like you know two o'clock. But yeah, so I'm gonna keep wearing this. Uh, this is my first check-in. Um, I will do one more check-in and give you guys my final thoughts at the end of the day. So see you guys later. Reset. Hi guys, so I am doing my second check-in. I'm actually by the lake. So pretty. But um, you know, my baby's car. But yeah. Um oh my god, so I went to this like beauty expo or blood, whatever. Trash. <laughs> like it's literally everything that there is kind of trash. But yeah. But my foundation still looks pretty mad, like everything looks good um no creasing yet except right my nose have a little bit of creasing but nothing crazy um yeah everything still looks really good so 
and the foundation is six dollars shade range trash but you know this kind of looks fine right now i've been wearing this foundation for about five hours so and i'm outside and it's like 70 something degrees so it's crazy but yeah so this is my final check-in i will give you guys my final thoughts at the end of the night so see you guys later hold me on a new vibe bitch you blowing my high gotta recalibrate my sunday yeah reset ain't nothing to start over Feeling like a past life Can't believe I saved your heart to break mine You could see I shifted shape to fit yours Can't forget I made the move to move on PCH to the Potomac River Take a break, recalibrate, forgive her Trip the road from Stockton to Stockholm Yeah Peace and grace to travel safe through time zone. Just my clock. Hi guys, we're back and time to give my final thoughts on this LA Colors truly matte long wearing high pigment foundation. So let's let's get into it. Let's get into it. So um I have a little little bit of stuff here. But apart from that, my face looks pretty let put my neck now. My face looks pretty good. I think my face looks really, really, really good. Um, I was actually outside walking around. Oh my god! Can I tell you guys this? I went to this like blowout, whatever, whatever they call it, like foundation. Um, not foundation, makeup blowout discount at this place. It's a hotel. They have a hotel. Trash. Like the brands that they have were like not stuff. I really know about and it was just garbage there was nothing good there like I was out in and out of there in two seconds but it was you know good to get a little experience um, to get some content so my husband and I went there but after breakfast but I don't recommend <laughs> I do not recommend it it was not good like it was terrible but hey, you know what? Maybe it was just terrible for me because there was I was expecting like a ton of like brand name stuff and then at a discounted price, but that wasn't the case. I think there's stuff from Rude, She, Beauty Creations, and like nothing crazy. So do not recommend. But yeah, back to this foundation. Six dollars. Like this foundation is six dollars. I think this foundation looks really good. Like it's it's not i think it had pretty good coverage the shade range is just 14 it's just 14 shades guys so i know a lot of people are gonna have issues finding a shade that actually matches them but apart from that i think you know it is a good foundation if you can get your hands on a shade that matches you i did get this at five and below which it's like a discounted store or not really a discounted store more like just a store that has stuff that's five dollars and below but you know what i've seen stuff there that's more than five dollars so maybe not everything is um five and below but six dollars man like i think that's a pretty good foundation for six dollars i just wish they had a little bit more shades but that seems to be like a common thing with like drug store beauty supply store discounted store that five dollar store dollar tree like all those like it just two it's like 10 shades 10 14 16 shades is the most i've seen and usually like they're just like terrible but yeah but this foundation i think is really good if you can get your hand on it definitely try it it's only six dollars if you get it at a five and below i only pay five dollars for it so that's it guys no <laughs> do i recommend this foundation yes a hundred percent yes six dollars you can't go wrong so that's it guys for this foundation friday don't forget to like subscribe join the family and you know what i'll see you on my next video bye guys
gotta recalibrate my sundial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reset.